Hi guys, so uh, now we have to put the grades in for ESIS, which is this Google Sheet shared by Husum today, the 13th of April. And I'd just like to show you a few steps to make this uh, a simpler process, because uh, at the moment we see this is by student, and then we have all the grades, but perhaps you just want to see your, just, just your grade and just your subject, so you can copy and paste, let's say, from another sheet. And also, we would typically do that here using the, the sort function, but we don't want to do it this way because it would make the sheet look different for everybody else. So we want our own private filters, which are just for us, which doesn't change the sheet for anybody else, for, for them going in. And actually, it's, it's really simple to do. Uh, and once you know how to do it, you'll know uh, for the future. So all we do here, this little uh, symbol here, which is create a filter, we click on the little drop down arrow here and we can create a new filter view. Okay, I'm going to call this filter view 7 boys ESS. Okay, so that's the name of the filter view, so I've named it. And now I'm going to make this filter view special just for 7 boys ESS. Okay, so I'm going to click on this inverted triangle here and I'm going to just select it so it just shows grade 7 and then for the subject I just want it to show ESS which here is known as Social Studies English and I just teach grade 7 boys so I just want it to show grade 7 boys okay and there we go so now it's in a much more friendlier format for me to enter the grades for grade 7 boys for ESS and again what I've changed here will not show on the Google form accessible by other people this is private and just for me however these filters can be found by, by anyone uh, and so yeah, so I've now made this filter so I can exit the filter and I get taken back to the standard view that everybody sees and I can access my saved filters now. I click on this drop down arrow and I can see all the different filters that I've made and I can just snap straight to 7 boys, snap, then I see grade 7 boys and I can make these filters for all my classes uh, so that when I put the grades in it's a simple and straightforward process as opposed to at the moment which is like this which can be a bit cumbersome all right so if you follow these steps i'm sure you can make your own filters and make things nice and quick for you as well and i hope that helps cheers